It was, uh, it was powerful, it was insightful, it was, yeah, it was, brilliant. It's, it's Walkley Award winning. You should one. be working for a current affair. Mm. Um, I believe a spot has just opened up. So. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you got any stories about Finchie? You guys worked together for a while? <laughs> Not so. that we can share here, oh. even on this show. <laughs> Not right. <laughs> That's... <laughs> Okay. That's a shame. Hey, look, uh, we did our research into you, Vonnie, your career and everything like that, because we're real professionals. Um, and we found out that you actually applied for a job at Fox Sports News <laughs> way back in 2010, before you went and got to be a big star at Channel 9. And we've got your original demo reel from Fox Sports News uh, almost eight years ago now. Let's have a look. Good afternoon, welcome to the Long Lunch on Fox Sports News. I'm Yvonne Sampson. We start with football and Uruguay are through to the semi-finals of the World Cup after beating Ghana in the most dramatic match of the tournament so far. Here I'd like to point out. Mm. Obviously different wardrobe now I, than... I think I cut my own yes. hair. Can we, bring, <laughs> can we bring the shot up again? Can we have a look? We've got a steal of what Vonnie... There we go. Yes. Let's look at that. I've uh, lost a few buttons, that's for sure. I was mm. really looking for a job. You were? <laughs> that's, can I just point out, so this is when you were just looking for an opportunity, so you'd virtually work for next to nothing. Yes, you know, my news director in uh, Seven in Queensland said I didn't have a future in television, so I had to come down here and try well, and find a job. I was desperate. So you, but then we, <laughs> Fox didn't take you on, so then you went to Nine, became one of the leading sports broadcasters in this country, and then you've come back here seven years later on Maddie John's money, so well done, Fox. <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> Whoever's in the talent, whoever's spotting talent, well done. That's right. I don't think Is he, he still works. working? No, I don't no, think no, so. No, I think he lost his job on that one. Yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. Don't too. be disheartened, though, Vonnie. You didn't get that job. But uh, it's a really high bar, they said, at Fox Sports News. I mean, let's have a look at some of the people that did get the job. We have a couple of special guests in the studio, Tim Cahill and Michael Bridges. Tim's not saying much, so Michael, I'll come straight to you. What a night. <laughs> to the NRL decider now. Oh, thank you very thank much. You. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Alrighty then, coming up to this short break here on the one left, we hear from AFL CEO. It's official, NRL fans have just one more year to enjoy Sam Burgess. The South Sydney star is off to pursue his rugby world cup dream. I understand. It's a it's big, up here. It is. It's up here. It is. Now, Vonnie, it's Origin P 